Going to the virtual field, reporter Hunter Boozer has the simulation for Troy's upcoming football game against Coastal Carolina. And we'll find out if the curse of the simulation will be broken. There's a legend that's been spreading around the college football world in the past few weeks. The legend states that a team who is simulated in the virtual world gets cursed in real life. However, there is a way to beat this by beating a Shana Clear during homecoming. Not only is a Shana Clear coming to the vet, but a whole flock of them named Coastal Carolina. Let's see how College Football 25 predicts Troy will do against this flock. The hosting Trojans are 1-7, coming off a 34-31 road loss to Arkansas State. Coastal Carolina is 4-3, coming off a home loss to Louisiana, that score being 34-24. Troy would get the ball to start the game, hand off to Damian Taylor. He would fumble the ball, and Coastal Carolina's A.J. Williams would recover. Coastal, however, would be forced to kick from 37 yards. They would go wide right, giving the Trojans back the ball. Troy would have to punt, however, and Coastal Carolina would get their second chance to make a field goal. They would get that one from 21. The Chanticleers would have another shot at a field goal from 21. It would doink off the right upright. So the score would only be 3-0 going into the half. Coastal Carolina would make up for those missed field goals as Christian Washington would take it to the house 73 yards to put the score at 10-0. It would only take two plays for Troy to get back into it first. Devontae Ross would catch a 67-yard pass to put Troy into Coastal's red zone. The very next play, Peyton Higgins would catch a 15-yard touchdown to put seven points on the board. After back-to-back -back punts, the Shana Clears would get their second touchdown as Ethan Vasco connected with Kyrie Duplass. Troy would be unable to score, and Coastal Carolina would walk away with the win with Christian Washington being the player of the game. Although Troy couldn't win in the virtual world, hopefully the curse can truly be lifted come homecoming. Hunter Boozer, Troy, Trojan Vision News. The Trojans take on the Chanticleer Saturday at the Vet.